Okay, for question number 16, uh, the case given that AC and AB are tangents to a circle. So these are the tangents to a circle. And it's given that angle COD is 120 degree. We have to find angle BAO. So let's redraw this figure. This is the circle. This is the tangent AB. So this is AB and this is the tangent AC. This is O and this is C. And this is the line passing through the center, which is joining the diameter as well. And this is the angle that we have to find out. And it's given that angle C is 120 degree. So angle C O D is equal to 120 degree, which will give us angle A O C. So A O C is 180 degree minus 20 because these two angles make the linear pair, which so this angle is 60 degree now. This one is 90 degree. So O C is perpendicular to A C because radius is perpendicular to the tangent and the point of contact. And now if we use the angle sum property in triangle AOC, so in triangle AOC, in triangle AOC, angle OAC plus angle AOC plus angle ACO is equal to 180 degree and this is because of the angles of property of triangle. Now angle OAC is unknown, AOC is 60 plus 90 degree which gives us angle AOC is equal to 180 minus 150, which is equal to 30 degree. So this angle is 30 degree and this angle is also 30 degree because the line joining the center to the common point, to the external point of the two tangents from where they are drawn makes equal angles with the tangents. So this angle is also one this angle is also 30 degrees. So angle OAB is equal to angle OAC, which is equal to 30 degrees. So this is option A is the correct answer for question number 16. Let's move on to question number 17.